Hello everyone. We are today at the University of Auckland Structural Testing Hall to test one of the future of box steel sections in compression. This one in specific is a FD310 section. This is a very specimen that we are testing today. Uh, it has been well tested in compression and as you can see the buckling and area bolts uh, uh, of the section. I'm here with Puyaku Nadi, uh, who is my colleague at Futura, and he has designed this test setup uh, for compression testing of Futura box sections. Puyo, what do we expect to get out of these tests? Well, in this test, we are applying a compression force to the columns, measuring the displacement and the force in the columns, so uh, trying to find out what is the capacity of these columns and comparing with the standards, uh, the, the standard formulas that are in the codes, uh, and compare it, you know, and how different we are. So as you see, for example, this is a box section in cold form steel. Producing a box section for cold form steel is a challenging one. So here in Kichera, we are producing a box section from a flat coil of uh, sheet, a uh, steel sheet, and you know to make it completely close you know we have a seam with some clinches here so as you see the compression force the seam with these clinches behave very well so then it proves that we have a very good and reliable box yeah. section yeah so as you can see here so at future we have to put up this innovative system and um, this is slightly different to conventional Cultural steel sections, which are technically C or Z sections. Um, so, this is acting um, as a box um, section. So, we have we, we, achieved um, quite a bit higher capacity than um, typical cold form steel sections. So, if you just do a complete around, uh, you can see on the other side of the section um, that this has been just a cold forming. This has been under enormous uh, pressure and enormous amount of force at the moment, and we are just seeing uh, the end of the test. Uh, the machine that we are using uh, for these tests is called an um, uh, Avery machine. Avery is an English-made uh, machine. It's, it's been used for several years, and it's got the capacity of up to 500 kilonewton. Yes, Rushi with me, he's, uh, she's a PhD student at the University of Auckland. Um, she's uh, doing these tests as, as, well, as part of her uh, PhD program, which we are supporting at uh, Futura. So uh, what, once the, the, the specimen is loaded, uh, we can see uh, the load versus displacement uh, uh, graph uh, here uh, on this screen. And as you can see, uh, Rushi is now unloading um, the specimen and, and as you can see the load is just dropping to zero and we, we've been measuring through two lines um, and this is uh, quite a large uh, capacity to get out of a, um, a cold form steel section and that's it that is what we do at Futura we try to defy gravity with our innovative and new systems for cold form steel sections